and the University of Mary Harden Baylor announced the retirement of a legendary coach. Six News reporter Matt Lively met with former crew coaches and his players this afternoon for their take. 24 years after starting the UMHB football program, head coach Pete Fredenberg has announced his retirement. He's going out on top, winning the Stag Bowl just less than a month ago. Announcing today that I am retiring as the head football coach. I had 24 glorious years. Two national championships, 231 wins, and hundreds of players coached. The legacy that Pete Fredenberg leaves behind at UMHB is epic. I'm glad he went out on top, that's for sure. <laughs> I think that's my, my biggest thing. I'm sure he wants to go out on top also. But uh, yeah, it was the uh, uh, end of a legendary era. Jarrell Freeman was an All-American for the Crusaders, playing from 04 to 08 and in the NFL for five years. From D3 to the pros, he says Fredenberg had a major hand. I think it's all a part of that that mentality that helped me progress it and, and get there to where I was like, oh, we got pro scouts coming out here. And, you know, Coach Fred pulled me off to the side. He's like, hey, you have opportunity. So uh, just continue to do what you do uh, and, and, and be who you are. The school has announced that longtime defensive coordinator Larry Harmon will become the second head coach in school history. Tonight at 10, we speak to more former crew members and how Fredenberg impacted them. In Belton, Matt Lively, 6 News.